In this video, we will learn what's new in the new version of Tesla Scatter 2. In the new version, we add several graphical objects like selector, tanks with trends, and gauges. Let's start. We add new object selector. You can find it in the controls library. And choose selector. We bind this object to object's property selected to motor speed and choose collections. In this collections we add buttons to the selector and values of these buttons. For example, we added two default buttons to 100 and 200 speed and add new speed, for example, 3 let's see now add new tanks with history informations for this click tanks and choose Vertical tank with strand or horizontal tank with strand. We will choose horizontal tank with strand. Add end on the screen and change dimensions to fit. Choose 2D and choose fill-in property. We will choose level tag because it supports history information click ok and you can change start time by clicking on the tank Now let's add gauges on, the, on our project. Choose analog methods library and choose gauge what we want to add. We have several types of gauges. Let's change value property of this object. Bind to the voltage tag. Change maximum and minimum properties. And change range of this object. For example, from 260 to 280, the color of the range will be red. From um, 240 to 260, the color will be yellow. Yellow. Also, it will be green. You can choose decimal position of the range and you can choose show history information and choose show use digital change label voltage choose minimum one to one seven okay you can see our ranges and now we can test.
and if I get to add voltage to how much to history. Now you can see history information with this arc. Shows the diapason of the value. And now in this way you can add all other ranges, all the gauges. For example, we can add 180 degree gauge bind to the current value. Mark minimum and maximum to all values, and we can see we didn't bind this gauge to history information, so we don't have history arc. That's all. You can also test, test it in Tesla SCADA one time, for example. Open this our project and click start. Here level history information these trends and change speed of our pump. Okay. If you have any questions, please write us on our form or email us.